<laughs> what is this? Monstrosity! Oh god! I'm gonna like get rid of a little bit of that. Here it goes. Not vomit inducing. I'm loving it. Hey everybody, welcome back to the Peebs channel. Today, feeling very hungry. So I have ordered every single McDonald's meal menu hack there is. If you're not familiar, McDonald's recently has started advertising these menu hacks. They're basically like sandwiches on top of sandwiches. There's four in total, and I'm a little bit late to this party, but they're definitely still selling these. I wanted to try them out myself, give them a little bit of a review. We've definitely done some fast food toy videos, but this is my first time actually eating fast food on the channel. If you like this, let me know. Hit the like button, let me know in the comments, all that stuff. We're always just trying new stuff on this channel. Uh, we have fun over here. Want to see what you guys like, and um, we're we're willing to try a bunch of new stuff. So again, if you see anything you like, let us know. I looked up the reviews for all of these and everybody's like, it's disgusting. Ugh. But as a disgusting individual myself, I'd like to think that uh, I might appreciate the McDonald's menu hacks. So I'm gonna give them a fair shot. I'm going into this optimistically. And also again, I'm very, very hungry. So <laughs> I really hope they're good. The way they're advertised, I definitely thought that they were gonna be like pre-made. They're definitely not. This is just a giant bag of sandwiches. It's a, an insane amount of, of food. I have to build these myself. What the heck is that? I don't even know how to do this. Your mans can barely build a Lego with video instructions. How am I supposed to make a meal? I'm not qualified to work at McDonald's. I'm a YouTuber. Okay, so they gave me some instructions here, but there's only instru instructions for three of them. There's definitely four. I even asked. I'm Googling how to eat my McDonald's. Okay, yeah. See, there's the Crunchy Double, the Hash Brown McMuffin, the Land, Air, and Sea, and the Surf and Turf. They left the Surf and Turf off of this one for some reason. I guess it's the least popular. I don't know. I'm going to start with the one I think will be the best. Make my way towards the end of the one I'm like not so sure about. I'm going to eat the Hash Brown McMuffin first. This can't be bad. It's just like a McMuffin with a Hash Brown. On it. And now I have to find <laughs> I have to find the food in, in in inside of here. What is what am I what do I need here? I need I got a Big Mac, two Big Macs, McChicken or chicken nuggets, I got a double cheeseburger, a McChicken, a number six with extra dip. A hot and spicy? They still they still have hot and spicy McChickens? I love hot and spicy McChickens. Another double cheeseburger? How am I gonna eat all this? And a fillet of fish. How many fillet of fishes are in this? Three? Looks like I actually didn't get the breakfast one. All right, well, I'm gonna have to go to McDonald's in the morning. <laughs> and uh, I'll film that, we'll put it right here. Good morning. I got breakfast. I was having a really good dream this morning and all of a sudden my alarm went off so freaking loud. It woke me up and then Luca jumped on the bed and started jumping all over me and clawing me in the face. But other than that, it's been a great morning. Yeah, so this one's literally just a sausage, egg, and cheese McMuffin with a hash brown on top of it. Sandwich, hash brown. I gotta say, this is maybe a spoiler for the rest of the video, I don't know, but after <laughs> after all the McDonald's I had, this is the last thing I want right now. Doesn't look bad, though. Yeah, this is good. This, this is just a quicker way to eat. Here, McDonald's breakfast combo, honestly. This isn't even weird at all. I've always been a big fan of putting like chips on my sandwiches. It's basically the same thing. Even after all the freaking McDonald's I have, I'll give this one a thumbs up. Okay, the, the, the McGriddle breakfast thing, I'm sure that was good. Now we're gonna move on to the crunchy double. Ooh, French fry. There was a French fry. I'm lucky. Okay, the crunchy double. This can't be too hard, right? Let's see, how do you do it? I think it's just a double cheeseburger. Oh, I have the instructions for that one right here, okay. So a double cheeseburger, one of my many double cheeseburgers, six piece chicken nuggets, and barbecue sauce. This can't be bad. I didn't think about this, but I need a plate. <laughs> You know what? No, no. I'm only gonna use what they gave me. And they didn't give me a plate, so. All right, here's the uh, double cheeseburger. So you put the chicken nuggets on the bottom. Do I got to fit all six of them? That won't even fit. I'm not gonna put all six because they will not fit. And then you pour barbecue sauce on the bottom. So I'm sitting there, barbecue sauce on my titties. <laughs> <laughs> this is a delicacy. Mm. 
There we go. Look at that. Okay, this one I feel like it can't be bad. The ones with the filet of fish that's what I'm worried about. I don't normally like onions, but I, I just got them the way they came. I felt like it's the only fair way to do it, right? Alright, there it is. The crunchy McDouble or whatever. Bottoms up. Cheers. That was just a bite of ch chicken nugget. I need another one. After reviewing the play, it's an incomplete pass. <laughs> that was sexy. Even seductive. I can't lie. <laughs> That's actually good as hell, dude. Let me get a bite with the pickles. It's not bad, dude. That's actually pretty good. I can't lie. All those hoity-toity reviews I saw, like, oh man, it was disgusting. What, what? I mean, that's not bad. I like that. I'm actually having a hard time not eating more of it because I have more. I have three more to eat. Even, even the onions. I don't normally like onions, especially like these little diced up onions and cheeseburgers. But even the onions, even the onions are good. <laughs> Mmm, I'm trashy and I love it. All right, that's really good. I'm actually probably gonna finish this later, but uh, you know, I don't want to fill myself up. I'm, I'm excited for the land, sea, and turf or whatever it is. All right, what's next on the menu? The surf and turf. Beef meets fish in this menu hack. Did anyone ask for that? See, the chicken and the beef, you know, that with the barbecue side, that actually, you know, that works to me. But did anyone, does, did anyone want fish and beef mixed together? No. Combine two 100% pure beef burger patties seasoned with just a pinch of salt and pepper with, it's just a double cheeseburger, with fish sourced from sub su sustainably managed fisheries on melty American cheese. That's just a, that's just a filet of fish. It sounds better when you use all these extra words. Top it off with tangy pickles, chopped onions, ketchup, mustard, and creamy McDonald's tartar sauce. Get a double and a filet of fish cheeseburger when you order it by name and make it yourself. So you, could, you just order it and put it together. 830 calories. Ooh. Yikes. Okay, so I need another double cheeseburger. It looks like they're expecting me to uh, separate the patties like this. It looks a lot better in the picture <laughs> than when I do it. And then just put a filet of fish inside of it, I guess. Here's my filet of fish. The tartar sauce is very well placed. Some in the, in the corner of the box there. I think I'm supposed to take off the top bun from based on the picture. Just put that right there. <laughs> Perfect. Hey, I could work at McDonald's. Just throw this away, I guess, and then just put it back. It's that easy, dude. <laughs> what is this monstrosity? Oh, God. <laughs> I'm definitely using that for the thumbnail. To be fair, that's where all the tartar sauce is falling off, so I'll give, I'll give it the full 360. There it is. I'm gonna, like, get rid of a little bit of that tartar sauce before I actually take a bite. All right, here it goes. I don't even know if I've ever had a filet of fish. I know people do like it, right? People like play of fish, right? I hope so. Cheers. Mm. Okay. I want to be like, disgusting, but it's actually not that bad. It's really not. I mean, I would never in my life order this. Like, why would anyone? I mean, I, I did not order it, <laughs> to be clear. I would never in my life outside of a YouTube video or just sheer curiosity order this. Like, I would never order this again. And it's certainly not as good as the other one. Cause I know, I know people do surf and turf like steak and fish, but like beef patty burger with like fried fish. It just like, it's very weird, but it's not like vomit inducing. That's my review. McDonald's surf and turf. Not vomit inducing. It's time to move on to the last one. So this is a Big Mac plus a McChishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishishish
You expect me to to do to like actually let it so that you can see? Wow, entitled much. Got the McChicken, got the uh, Big Mac. This is what I'm really worried about here. This is what it's supposed to look like? I don't think it's gonna look anything like that. All right, now I'm starting to feel like a little bit gross. <laughs> All right, let's somehow get this Big Mac onto here. Okay, and we need the filet of fish too. All right, land, air, and sea. I saw people on Twitter that were like, why is it called land, air, and sea? Chicken can't fly. You sure about that? They can. Okay, so I gotta strip it down to the pa the first patty here. See, that's where you're gonna place uh, 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 your filet of fish. I'm pretty sure it's just the patty. Yeah, so they're really wasting a lot of filet of fish bread here. I think I don't need this. Let me hold on to it. So you gotta get this amazing looking fish patty. Part of it stayed on the bun, and the cheese did also, but I think there's gonna be enough cheese onto this. Place that right there. Beautiful. Then there's just the continuation of the Big Mac, I guess, like that. And then, oh, specifically wants the seed, the sesame seed bun, so. I think, yeah, then it's just the patty. I mean, it's supposed to have some of the lettuce and the mayonnaise, I assume. Just the patty of the McChicken on the top. Oh my god, this is disgusting. And then, uh, there it is. <laughs> uh, there it is. I can't, how do I even pick this up? Let me discard of the excess bread. My dogs are gonna get plenty of bread. I'll make sure to wipe the onions off of it. It looks terrible. Get a nice little spin. And I took my little turn on the catwalk. On the catwalk. On the catwalk. Oh, yeah. How am I supposed to take a bite of this? <sighs> All right, that's where I'm going in, right there. I'm gonna get some uh, Big Mac sauce, cheese, burger, fish, lettuce, bun, more Big Mac sauce, mayonnaise, tartar sauce, chicken, and more bun, sesame seed bun. That's what really makes it classy. All in one bite somehow. Okay, <clears throat> gotta cleanse my palate first. I'm kind of stalling a little bit here. <laughs> <sighs> Just imagine this is you doing it. It's like, it's almost like you're tasting it. I'm describing it so well. It's almost like you're to also- Get you're that nasty out of my right face! Now. Is there anything else funny I could say or just even stupid or annoying I could say? Anything I could say at all that will allow me to stall further. All right, <clears throat> positive thoughts. This is gonna be the best one yet. I can't, <laughs> I actually can't. <laughs> Sorry about that. Surprised my face didn't look even more disgusting. I barely even know what I just ate. Like, <laughs> my taste buds are so confused. I can't like individually taste any of that. It just like all, it just tasted like generic McDonald's taste, flavor all at once, which is literally what it is. But I can't, I can't like sit here and act like it was disgusting. It's just weird. Part of it is normally when I'm sitting here doing food videos on peeves, I'm eating something like super gross. So this in comparison to like some of the gross stuff I've had and, and drank on this channel, this is, uh, I mean, I don't know. I'll take another bite. <laughs> Delicious. I don't recommend it. It's a waste of money. It's most certainly a waste of food because you're probably not going to be e able to eat all this. And I guess like the chicken nugget one didn't waste bread. Some of them, some of them wasted a lot of bread though. So it's kind of a waste of food. Way too many calories. But I don't know. They're, they're honestly they're not that bad. Like I want I wanted to make a video like oh it's so funny how bad they are, but uh, I don't know. I have too refined of tastes, I guess. Ah, oh, that boy ain't right. I'm gonna eat all the rest of all three of these. Uh, I'm about to go to sleep, uh, the night of doing this video. This was not planned. And I know I said in the video itself that, like, the food hacks weren't that bad. I'm not, like, necessarily taking back what I said in that moment. Because I did, I did actually think that in the moment. 
but I do have to say that the longer the day has gone, uh, the, 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 the less I, the more I just can't think about these menu hacks that I ate without just like hating myself a lot. It's, I know it's kind of normal with like fast food, like, oh, I mean, I had Taco Bell and it wasn't that good. I mean, it was so good when I was eating it, but like, oh, afterwards, I was just like, ugh, I regretted it. It's like that times 10. Uh, I, I like, I'm wait, like, this is 2.50 in the morning. I'm just about to go to sleep. It's, it's just hours and hours. It's like half a day since, since I, I had, had that stuff. And it did, it, it didn't sit well with me like the first couple hours after, but I was really, really full. I felt like I'd never need to eat again because of the sheer amount of calories that I had. And I still haven't eaten since then. It's way past that. I feel totally fine. Like, you know, I kind of, I was kind of craving like a freaking chocolate chip cookie or something earlier. So it's like, I have my appetite back, but still over time, every hour thinking about eating those sandwiches with the filet of fish on them and the chicken and all of that fucking filth. It gets worse every hour, every single freaking hour, and I, I'm not, I can't even like sell it. Like, oh wow, well, well, like I'm, I'm not on anymore. I'm about to go to sleep. Literally, uh, this is just, this is just pure thoughts, pure thoughts. Those sandwiches are fucking disgusting, dude. Like, they shouldn't be allowed. Don't eat them.